While one generation defining Ryder's premature exit from the tour at the weekend had us baying for a change to his retirement plans and one more year, another great showman of the last 10 years was experiencing an uncharacteristically uneventful start to his final lap of France. Peter Sagan won't retire this year, but this will be the 33-year-old's last season riding World Tour races for a tilt at the Olympic cross-country mountain bike event in 2024. Hence, for this race, it will indeed be the end of an era. Peter, what will you miss about all of this? Who knows? I'm going to tell you next year what I'm going to miss. But definitely, yeah, it's... Uh, it's nice to be here, but it's also very hard to be here, you know. <laughs> Eleven summers ago, this was a sport still crawling out from under the rubble of the scandal-ravaged noughties, with the Sky Dynasty just beginning and Cavendish apart, a distinct lack of swagger and sparkle dust. The 2012 tour, though, served as the world premiere for a new box office attraction. Incredible Hulk one day, Forrest Gump the next. Peter Sagan commanded the stage and won three of them in his first week on the race. For most of the next decade, the sky rain would polarize, while the Slovaks was a unifying force. He, the great entertainer, a court jester wearing a superhero's cape. Good memories. It's, uh, it was a little bit different. <laughs> <What? Done. laughs> a presence that transcended the numbers, but what numbers? What is he doing? <laughs> seven green jerseys, 12 stage wins, and maybe most impressive, 55 top three finishes in stages between 2012 and 2020. Oh, well, I think uh, everything what I achieved during the Tour de France is, uh, is nice. I'm proud of uh, the seven green jerseys, uh, the, the stage victories. Uh, also in bad moment that I pass and I survive in the Tour de France, you know? In 2020, a pandemic changed the world, and in cycling, either catalyzed or coincided with a changing of the guard. The new all-action heroes were called Van Aert and Van der Poel, while a Slovenian inherited the Slovakian's panache, his brilliance, and increasingly, shades of his humor. Meanwhile, the former Alpha's demeanor increasingly resembles that of an old grizzly plodding towards a final hibernation. One last swipe of those mighty paws for old time's sake. We, he can dream as we cherish those memories of the summers of Sagan. Definitely I'm enjoying his last tour of France and uh, I'm enjoying the people around, the atmosphere. I'm looking at uh, Tour de France from a different angle now than, uh, than before, but uh, for sure I would like to try to do something if uh, my legs allowed me. 